<laughs> yeah, I suppose it is a wee bit of a night off. We, we've had uh, quite a number of boys now crying off on a Monday, you know, maybe not quite recovered properly from a, from a Saturday, certainly with leg knocks and, and stiffness and soreness in the bottom half of the legs. Like So this is something a bit different. We always try to think slightly outside the box and do something that keeps the boys, uh, keeps their imagination going and it keeps them thinking and, and it's something just a slightly different. Yeah, it's, it's a wee bit of boxer size, so it is like, I mean, with, with uh, a Billy Boyd, Nat, who works for BCSDN, it's a company I work for, and, and Billy was a great amateur boxer himself, so he comes with a lot of pedigree, and, and uh, we do this with the guys at work, and, and he's done this with us a number of times, like, and it's, it's really, really good fun, it's something slightly different, and it's a great workout. Yeah, it's just got all uh, transferable skills, I suppose. You know, certainly when boxing out there, people underestimate how much you use your bottom half, how much you use your feet. It's lower intensity in terms of there's not running or kicking and everybody getting hurt that way, but it is the fast feet element of it, about moving your feet, about your balance, your coordination. You know, and now he's going to work a bit on their upper body as well. So he is like, so no, but like I say, it's it's a fantastic workout and it's a bit of fun for the boys too. It's. I think in out there, if you're just constantly, it's a hundred football, 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 football. You know, it can come a little bit stale. So it's always nice to throw a little bit of a curveball in there and something a little bit different. Keep it going. Keep moving. Doing well. Keep it going. I think if some of the boys tried a bit of boxing, didn't they? The white collar stuff. There it is. We've got the uh, Canelo there, like so we have Kim Nielsen, the, 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 the ginger the ginger Mexican. You know, fat Paddy Barnes we've got there like as well, like and we uh, we mackers. We've got a few big lumps so we have as well, a few few heavyweights here so we have so no I wouldn't fancy taking a jab off too many of them. Harmo looks like he can handle them off as well, don't he? He looks like he's been in the boxing ring a few times before, so no, they're all good. Strength, right? Don't go on, don't you go punch too much, just a little bit, just to take the impact of the punch. Go, go! Yes! Ah, it's it! Who said you are better than that last break? That's it, put it in, lads, put it in. I am just doing a wee bit of boxing, a um, wee bit of cardio mixed in with. Um, I think the gaffer just brought it in to mix it up a wee bit. Um, oh. Just loosen us out from Saturday, you know, boys be a bit tight on the Monday as well, so just to get a bit of fun on it and uh, ease it down a wee bit. Well, that's it, it's a bit of crack as well, you know what I mean? Just getting the boys enjoyment and stuff. And obviously, we'll be back in tomorrow night doing the usual, going through the football and drills and stuff. But um, you know, that was good crack, it was enjoyable for all the boys, and you got a good workout too. Everything's working on your fitness. Um, it's the same when you're doing the football and drills and stuff, obviously, it's a lot more in the legs, but you know, that was a change and a bit of crack tonight. Ah, uh, well, very briefly, a lot of years ago. Um, I like to do a wee bit of training, hitting the bags and stuff in the gym, but you know, never fought competitively, like, not for a while yet, anyway.